Oh, hey. It's good to see you. Yeah. Oh, it's been a while. Been a while. Mm-hmm. When's the last time I... When's the last time you've come to see me? Oh, no. No, 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 no. That just won't do. You should know by now that you've really got to come see me more often. I wouldn't want you to go all mad on us, would you? Yeah. I didn't think so. So. What you've been up to since the last time you seen me? Mm, two. Really? Well, not more than double was the last time. Yeah. Mm. No. The bat. Really? That is just too bad. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well. Why don't you have a seat and go ahead and uh, yeah, let's talk about you. Oh, come on, tell Dr. J what's going on. What's new in your life? Yeah, what's bothering you, stressing you out? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, it's it's understandable. I I know I too have an indecisive personality. You know, I wake up some mornings and I wonder shall I rob a bank today or or shall I kill an innocent bystander, you know, just the big life decisions. In the morning, you know? Oh, you couldn't decide whether, whether you wanted cereal or eggs for breakfast. Well, I guess that, that's important too. Every decision is an important decision, you know? Every decision can lead us in a different path. You know? Hmm. So what about, um... What about the people in your life? Are they treating you well? Really? Promoted to henchmen? Well, that's... That's great. Yeah. You're making real progress. Since the last time we talked. A train. That's fantastic. I told you to encourage those voices. I almost thought you lost them there for a minute. And losing the voices in your head is like losing a part of who you are altogether. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. We're not here to talk about me. Although I am doing fine, I must say. Yeah, yeah. Well, I've been building up my gang of crazies and we've been terrorizing the town as we do <laughs> yeah yeah well, a little bit of violence here a little bit of chaos there it's all the same really at the end of the day what kind of chaos have you been up to lately hmm. oh a new boss and how does he change the dynamic of your missions, your activities? Really? Well, how does that make you feel? Hmm. Maybe I 
should write this down. I think it'd probably be best. Just one moment. Let me grab my notepad over here. Mm -hmm. And does he treat your fellow workers the same way? Mm, okay. mm, so it's an individualized sort of attack. Mm. And what do you think you could be doing to improve the situation? You know what we've talked about, and we know that we cannot continue to try the same thing over and over again and expect a different result, you know? So you can't just be submissive or dismissive. Um, you have to become empowered. You need to stand up for yourself. We've talked about this. Mm -hmm. You can't let people walk all over you, no matter what the situation, whether you're trying to um, buy groceries or steal groceries at the grocery store and someone cuts ahead of you. Even something as simple as that, you need to. You need to stand up and say no. Not today. Not today. Today, I am king or queen, prince, whatever, whatever you want to be, really. Today, I am emperor. Emperor J. <laughs> you know, actually, it doesn't have it doesn't have a bad ring to it. <laughs> emperor J. But really. I think you need to focus on you. Uh, how's the home life, you know? Um, and in your relationship lately? Really? Huh. Well, what's her name? Harley. It's a rather peculiar name for a woman. What she look like? Just asking. Oh, you have a picture on your phone. I'm kidding. Yeah. No. Oh, hey. Uh. Hmm. This is her? Oh. Oh well. Good job. I'm impressed. No, no, uh, I mean, you're very attractive yourself. Yeah. Mm. In your own unique way. Yeah. Anyways, um, and you started the new boss, yeah, and you have a new girlfriend. Um, what, what do you think your next chapter is? Like, how do you keep moving forward from here? Well, uh, you could always start with a plan. Um, or like a basic skeleton or plan and jot down different ideas of what you'd like to do. You know, you could even make um, a bucket list of sorts, you know. Like, I want to do this before uh, the bat kills me because he kills everyone, so. And we're the bad guys, right? <laughs> I think it's ridiculous. Crazy, even. And we know I'm crazy with capital K. <laughs> I mean, you must be crazier considering I'm your therapist. <laughs> You're the one who chose to come here. <laughs> Wait. 
And don't keep coming back. Trust me, we still have plenty of other things to do. How's your self-confidence level feeling lately? Good, bad, ugly? A little mix of all three at different times, yeah? Well, when do you feel good? Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's a good time. Yeah. When do you feel bad? When you look in the mirror, yeah. Most of us do, yeah. Uh, at least we don't have the... Uh, Now you feel better, don't you? What about ugly? When you do something bad. Well, defined bad then, you know? When you do something that's illegal. You're an undercover cop. This whole freaking time. <sighs> I thought we were friends, man. I thought we were friends. Doctor patient friends. Here, this whole time you've been an undercover freaking cop. I realize I'm gonna have to kill you now, right? No, no, no. Don't be scared. Don't worry. We were friends. I'm not gonna make it. Just... 